Hello, this is H.C. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Lilfia! I'd like to thank H.C. Uh, Santa for filling in for me yesterday while I was spending time with my family on this Christmas holiday. Went up to Wisconsin myself. It was quite a drive. My brother, he got me a, a gate. Ooh, a poison pen. Uh, that's instant death, by the way. But my brother, he got me a little gate for my office because, well, it can get a little hot in there. Well, not really an office. My studio, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> but anyway, so it gets a little hot in my studio because well, I got like three computers running at the same time, right? And it's a, like a hundred square foot room. So he got me this little gate to keep the cats out of there, right? The cats found a way to get over the gate in about five minutes. It's the thought that counts. I appreciate it, bro. I really do. It's more thoughtful than the gift I got for him. I just got a uh, two-month World of Warcraft subscription for him, or gift card, or whatever it was. I don't think there's any enemies in this cave here. Huh. Well, there we go. We gotta get over to Belgium there. I also got... What was it? My fiancé. Ooh, we got a new enemy here. Poison Rats. Let's deal with them. Uh, my fiance got me season one of, uh, what was that show? Uh, Burn Notice, because I never saw season one. I didn't really get into the show until season three, so. Well, there we go. Okay, now that we've got that out of the way, let's get back to what you really came here to watch after I've been two minutes into the video, and that is Lufia. We can go through that cave there. Now we can get to Belgian to find an elf to help us get to, uh, where are we going? Alfreya. There we go. Alright. Made in one piece. What's going on? I need your authorization password! Ah, uh, we're human. That's not how you spell travelers. This is the North American version of the game. It's not the European version. Although I probably will be playing the European version of uh, Lufia 2 for a very specific reason, but We'll get to that soon enough, dude. Soon enough. What do you mean, last time? This is the first time. For the last time. Well, anyway, while we're still here, or while we are here, you definitely, even though it was just like a little short trip on the way here, absolutely rest up at the end for what I'm going to be doing next. Now let's take a look around. Okay, how's it going? A ransom? Can't believe... How would you get give in to the monsters. They would just kidnap someone else and ransom them again. How could you? Well, let's see what they sell here. Anything interesting? Uh, not yet. I'll save my shopping, my item shopping for later. I don't think there's any weapons I want to buy. No, no, not really. Not yet, anyway. Let's head on around here. Now well, they got the church here. Hmm, who's this Jaren you're talking about? Hmm. Well, let's, uh, save while we're here. Not that I'm actually using this to save, but, well, whatever. But anyway, let's go grab some more treasure! A float. Could've used that a moment ago, but, well, there we go. High potion. Awesome. How's it going? Well, what's going on? Well, you all kind of look the same here. Oh, no! Um, I'm not going to get into a Patama situation. Yeah, yeah, we got to go and save her, so. Oh, well, okay, there we go. I guess we got to solve this village's problems, too. So, maybe we'll get an elf out of the deal. Oh, some more treasure there. Power Gourd, can never have enough of those. Uh, let's see, nothing over here, but I do want to head to the left here. Ah, there's the armor shop. Why'd they put it so far away from the weapon shop? Eh, whatever. But anyway, I do want to get a bronze armor. How do you make a robe out of bronze? Well, anyway, we want to get one of those. And we want to get a couple tan shoes. They got pretty good defense. So, let's see how good that one is for him. Eh, it's a little better. Better than a sharp stick in the eye. Well, you do have a sharp stick, but yeah. Uh, let's see, we got uh, tan shoes. Little extra defense. I don't want to give them to Aguro because he's got the spike shoes and really for the most part, eventually, like with spike shoes, 
Um, the shoe, let's see, oh, that's a little better defense. Shoes generally aren't that useful for their defense. I mean, right now they are, but later on in the game they won't be. It's really more for strength and agility boosting, really. So that's what they're really useful for. Uh, you could send us to uh, rescue her. I think that's pronounced dice. I've heard it's also pronounced deus, but I'm gonna say dice because it sounds cool. Dice! Oh, well, how do we get there? Well, there was that cave that we were told about, so we gotta go over there then. Or you could leave it up to us. Okay, well that's all the uh, treasure we can get here. Got all the armor that I want to get while I'm here. What level am I at? Eh, I should be at level 14, but eh, whatever. We can make it. Now I'm going to do a little bit of sequence breaking to get some really good equipment. Because we have a lot of... Uh, what is it? We have a lot of money at this point in the game. So instead of going to the Southwest Cave, like we're supposed to, I'm going to head over to the next town instead. Because... Now I actually have the money. Earlier in the game when I could have done that, I figured, well, I didn't have the money, really, unless I sold a miracle. So, didn't want to do that then, but now I do. And we've got a lot of new enemies around here, so... Well, I forgot to do it after the last battle, but you pretty much absolutely want to stay at maximum HP. Because these enemies will kill you if, you, if you're not at max. Holy crap, they're kicking my ass. I don't think these guys have that much HP, or that much more, or that I can't deal with. Uh, yeah, they don't have any elemental weaknesses. Uh, well, these guys are weak to ice, but uh, well, I don't have any ice magic. Don't have ice magic. Don't have fire magic. What happened to all the good stuff? I mean, where, where are all these elements? Well, soon enough, viewers, soon enough. And don't worry about using all your MP on the way there. You'll be fine. Okay, here's where it gets a little harder. Uh, killer bees, okay. Uh, let's use dew on them. Another enemy there, red orb. They are, what is it with them? They, they can cast, oh, I didn't realize I could kill them that easily. Huh, well, there we go. Uh, the red orbs can cast mirror on themselves, so obviously don't attack them like that. Or don't use magic on them, that is. Attack them with your physical attacks. All right. More poison pins. Awesome. There we go. There's the level I'm looking for. Alright, that was just some more red orbs there. If you run into a large enough group of them because they can cast mirror, just use those high arrows that we've got. These things. Those are really nice against large groups of... or large groups of enemies. Not just one enemy. By the way... or not just... Uh, not all enemies. Just a group of them. Uh, one other thing is, I forgot to mention in the last episode, the bang spell that Lufia got, it's pretty much the same thing as the as a bomb, except, well, it's stronger, uh, because you're actually casting the spell. It hits all enemies for explosion elemental damage, so that's pretty nice. I really like that spell. And more of these guys to deal with. Eh, easy enough. I didn't realize that my do spell was that powerful. Do the do, Lufia! I, don't, I forget whether they can poison you or not. Not that I really care about uh, status ailments that much, but... Ooh, more poison pins. I'll save those for later. Those can be pretty useful. I, I don't know if they're guaranteed, but they seem to work pretty often. Better than instant death spells. Come on. Game! Game! Okay. Um, time to bring out the big boys. Bang. Bang him, Lufia! Bang him good. Maybe I should have had Adol target one of the orcs. Ow! You guys are kicking my ass. Can I get a turn, please? One time, dealer. One time! There we go. Wow! Look at that damage! Holy cow! Yeah, that's way better than actually using a bomb. So if you don't care about your um, MP, hey, go for it. Don't... Kill her? Well, I suppose it doesn't really matter. I can revive her. I think even in this game, even if you're dead, you'll or even stoned, you'll still get experience. How do I revive? There we go. It's been so long, I don't remember how to revive someone. Okay, don't kill me, don't kill me. Okay, there we go. 
Okay, we should be fine. Whew! Made it. Barely. Rest up at the end there. Okay. Yeah. 50? I didn't think it was 50 gold. I thought it was 40 gold. Huh. That's weird. Maybe the price changes. Huh. Well, that's weird. Anyway, there are some good things, really good things, that I want to get while I'm here, so... Huh, I'll forfeit. Forfeit? What's that mean? Huh. That's weird. Huh. That is a really weird place. We'll go there eventually, but... Uh, no, not yet. Huh, the Lost Forest. Huh. I wonder if the trees are inhabited, inhabited by temple guards. No. No. They're the spirit of a temple guard. But, anyway. Huh. The Lost Woods, huh? Okay, well, we gotta get an elf to get through there, but at least we know where we gotta go. Okay, so, first things first. Well, actually, the first thing I want to do is grab that treasure. There's a lot of stuff I want to buy here, so I'm probably just going to buy it all off screen and equip it and everything. But essentially, I'm going to put a shopping list there. But we want to get up to 20 antidotes, uh, 20 awakens, 10 mystery pins, 4 stone cures, 20 shrieks. We want to have all those. Let's see what else they got here. They sell a lot of really good stuff here, which is why... Well, you don't have sand in your boots. But, uh, yeah, that's why... And now we got all the money. That's why I don't have a problem with doing a little bit of sequence breaking, because you're probably not supposed to go here until later. Uh, let's see, the other stuff we can get here. I want to get two axes. Uh, let's see, a rapier. Let's see, 20 big arrows. They target one enemy, but it's massive damage. And I'd like to get 10 more high arrows while I'm at it. And for the armor shop, I think there's only one thing that I really want to buy here. So, well, let's see. I want to get a bronze shield for uh, Adol there. So I'm going to equip all that stuff, arrange my party as I have listed in the video description, and then I'll meet you back at Belgian to try and find a way to save Jaren. Next time on Let's Play Lufia! This is H.C. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day!